Second and seven from the 31. Here's Burrow. Oh, Clowney got to him. Look at that wobbler. What a hit it was. But he's fine. And look at this. There's a skirmish breaking out over on the sideline about that hit. And now the flags are flying. What is the rivalry called, Jim? Red. The red. The cities that get the top, Ohio. The Battle of Ohio. There you there go. There it is. Yeah. Something, something like that. The Battle of Ohio. And you can see mm. the tension. And the linemen didn't like the way that Clowney came after their quarterback. And he did. He took a big pop at the end of this waiting and should have got rid of that one a little earlier. She didn't have to take the hit. But this is a big call right now. Everyone's covered on the back end. Well, he's going to come in, boom. Oh, man. And that's worse than it even looks. <laughs> Should have been the flag here. It's close. Let's it get is Gene. very close. I, this is one that Gene Steratore can really help us out with. Well, Jim, I've looked at this, and I'm going to say, Gene, is it a penalty? I don't know. The thing is, after the play was over, personal foul, unnecessary roughness on the defense, number 96. 15-yard penalty, automatic, first down. So the penalty's called on Jordan Elliott. He was the one who hit Chris Boswell last week on the fake field goal pass play. And here he's in the middle of this. 96 on the outside, right over there. She comes in. I think the bigger question bigger question is should it have been a foul for the hit on Joe Burrow which well it played out that way either way right let's bring in Gene